Yeah, Tanya and Terrell, the fire department has given the all clear and there is no longer a smell of ammonia in the air. The fire department says they were able to safely get inside home city ice and shut off a valve. But earlier this morning, a heavy odor alerted residents. The Chicago Fire Department has given the all clear after an ammonia leak at a business in the Chicago Lawn neighborhood. We don't actually know exactly how it started. We got the call, so that's an investigation that will have to be con you know, conducted, not by us, but by another agency. Fire officials say someone called 911 after a strong smell of ammonia at around 4.30 this morning in the 3600 block of West 59th Street. Fire crews at a firehouse directly across the street also smelled it in the air, arriving quickly as a plume of ammonia was visible, billowing from the plant. Chopper 7 was above the scene as the fire department declared a level 2 hazmat response and closed streets for several blocks. Area residents were told to shelter in place. Based on the amount of people in this geographic area, we decided not to evacuate people for them to shelter in place, go door to door, and actually see how residents were doing with OEMC. We made sure that we checked on all residents, have them shut their windows and everything. The business called Home City Ice produces cubed and block ice. It was formerly known as Lang Ice. No one inside the plant was hurt. The company evacuated the building themselves. They self-evacuated prior to our arrival. But it's very surprising. We've never had an incident like this before, especially with that company. The company's been here for over 30 years. I know there's been conversation about change of hands in terms of whose ownership, but we've never had an incident like this. The weather on one of the hottest days of the year playing a role in the danger. Due to high humidity levels, ammonia can cause severe eye and throat irritation, breathing problems, and burns. There have been no reports reports of any injuries in the area and some residents this morning were not even aware of the leak. I'm amazed. I, I didn't even know what was going on. I thought it was a fire. So I'm just waking up. Back here live, there is an investigation, as you heard, underway to pinpoint the cause. Meanwhile, we've reached out to Home City Ice for comment, but we have not heard back, and they apparently are in business, it's business as usual this morning. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.